Born into one of the most privileged and prestigious families in Ghana, Dr. Karen Ajamain Prempe is a textbook example of being born with a silver spoon in her mouth. But the more I spoke to Dr. Ohima, as she is affectionately known, I began to realize that she, being Otunfo Oseito to the second's daughter, also means a lot of hard work. He's my father. I mean, I love him to bits, and uh, I can never stop loving him, can I? So, yeah, I leave it at that. Over the years, she has drawn her strength from that discipline. A critical attitude needed to begin and sustain her business while schooling in the UK. I came up with Seviva when I was in med, when I was in med school, and I didn't actually think I could do it on my own. I used to go around with my laptop teaching people about cervical cancer, and it was it was quite green to everyone. And today, I'm happy to say that people have, you know, decided to come on board and talk about it. Her agenda is to move women together to be united and dominate anything they may put their hands and minds to. Women in Africa seem to be oppressed, but when we are let loose, it's amazing how you know, remarkable things we do. So let's hold each other's hands, educate ourselves, you know, pull each other with us, and then let's build something huge for ourselves, like I, like I keep saying. I do my quota by going around educating women. It could be about cervical cancer, which I'm known for, but I also um, meet young women, talk to them about how to live their life, also um, be entrepreneurs, also participate in all sorts of um, good um, directions. When she's not attending to patients or fighting the cause of women, Dr. Ajamain Prempe, well, still works, but from home. She does her best to make some time for her siblings. She advises women in this society to be beneficial to other women around them and even those they do not know. We are calling on all women to dip their hand into the cake and be innovative, build smart, and then so we can all grow to be equal with men. Dr. Ajamain Prempe is excited about this year's International Women's Day and wants women all around the world to be celebrated in all areas of life. It's, it's the same old story where we're saying that men and women are equal and we should be treated equally and we should be given equal opportunities. We should be allowed to rise equal at the same level. I started building who I am from medical school and it wasn't huge. It was small, but it was smart. I think when we talk about innovation, African women in general are a bit, you know, we are already innovative, right? So translating that to Africa is supposed to be very easy. Happy International Women's Day to all the women out there.